He scored 5 goals and accounted for 1 assist in his first season for Djurgården. The potential is enormous. Now we're going to show Sweden what a super talent he is. Now we also show the Nordics, even Europe, why not the whole world. His brother also plays in the team and now the question is whether they will make this journey together or will their destinies go in different directions. Welcome to Sunday News. In the Jurgården team, there is an exciting player called Lucas Bergvall. Fabrizio Romano has been talking a lot about the player lately in the real world. This is not the real world. If you think so, seek help. Lucas Bergvall is really something extra, but one must not forget his brother Theo, who in the first season was responsible for 9 assists and 2 goals. I hope to steer the brothers to the same clubs and that their journey together will be a beautiful one. Djurgården came second in the league and they both contributed a lot. And just to be clear, Lucas plays as a midfielder and Theo is a right back. Their time at the club is coming to an end. The question is whether there will be any suitable clubs that show interest now in January or whether we have to wait until the summer. While I press the spacebar a couple of hundred times, you can think about whether you can press the subscribe button once. Lucas and Theo will move to Germany and play for Eintracht Frankfurt, who are currently having big problems in the league and are at the bottom. In this team we find another Swedish talent named Hugo Larsson, who welcomes the brothers with open arms. We will of course take control of the team and play the same way as we did in Djurgården. In one of their first matches for the new club they are involved in a lot. Lucas is involved in the first uh, goal of the game and Theo also has some opportunities. The next game Lucas even accounts for his first assist. Time flies in Germany for the Berryval brothers and Frankfurt have a tough period at the end of the season. But Lucas and Theo have no plans to move and are enjoying themselves in Frankfurt. Despite a bad form, Frankfurt comes in 9th place in the league. And I am full of anticipation for what the Swedes can achieve next season. It will be a dream start to the league. The goals are just pouring in. After 6 games, we are at the top of the table. The dream for the brothers is to win the Bundesliga, but in Frankfurt, they didn't think it would be possible. After the start of the league, the squad gets a little nervous, as it suddenly feels like it could be possible. Two more games to be played, and Frankfurt is taking distance at the top of the table. What is going on? In this team we have a really good striker who is also a fantastic leader. A player we look up to and right now is the top scorer in the league. His name is David Selke. January has passed and we have a dip in form, which has caused us to fall to second place and we are not exactly alone anymore. Against Hansa Rostock, Frankfurt wins easily and Lukas Bergwald accounts for one goal and one assist. He also scores against Stuttgart. Now all of a sudden we have three straight wins and the, the dream is alive. There are 12 games left, so now is the time to show everyone what we are capable of. We can't stop winning and the success echoes throughout Frankfurt. Bayern Munich is very hard to catch up to, but we're not giving up. But then something happens. Everything we worked so hard on during the season completely disappears in a short period of time and we lose two games. Even if we beat Freiburg and Darmstadt, we lose more points. The dream of winning the league is blown away. Lucas hugs his brother Theo and says, everything will be alright. Can you believe we are going to play the Champions League next year? It's done. You and me, brother. You and me. But little did he know that he wouldn't play more for Frankfurt. Because this summer, Barcelona makes a move. So Tottenham come and steal Lucas Bergvall. But Tottenham have no use in his brother Theo. So the next adventure will be without family. Thank you for watching. This is Lucas Bergvall 